Hey there guys, Fave here, and today we're going to talk about some interesting things that have been happening to the richest people on Roblox. So whenever you ask someone in the know, who is the richest Robloxian, they'll literally say Roblox, or Linkmon, or Son of Sevenless if they're really in the know. And I've made videos about all three of these subjects before, but I got an influx of DMs yesterday talking about, hey, oh my god, this is the biggest hack in Roblox history. Roblox and Linkmon got hacked. Did they get hacked? Well, I will answer that question and more after today's challenge. Today's challenge is, if you've ever clapped your hands before, smash that like button. Also, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell, and you will be blessed with 600 years of good luck. So... If we take a look here, this is a website that shows a person's value of their inventory. It's all of their limited items, how much Robux are worth put together. And this graph shows how much Robux someone was worth at a period in time. So on July 31st, 2020, Roblox's items were worth 200 million Robux put together. And then recently is 191 million Robux. That's some deflation, I guess. But evidently, you can see the big drop right here on Roblox's graph. And it's not just Roblox either, going from 191 million to 45 million. In fact, Linkmon99, the richest user on Roblox, not including admins, seems to have dropped his value too. And his alpha makes it even more suspicious. So did Roblox and Linkmon get hacked? No. Now I know it looks like they got hacked. I mean, Linkmon lost over 100 million Robux seemingly out of nowhere. I mean, where are all of his items, right? Well, here's the thing, right? If I go ahead and try to send Linkmon a trade, and I look at his inventory, well, first of all, you see this Emerald Valkyrie? Well, it doesn't show him owning any Emerald Valkyrie. And then, if we just keep looking here, let's just filter it to hat accessories, right? Well, ever since Roblox went down a few days ago, there's been a lot of problems with the site. And I'm going to talk about that in a second, but here's the thing. You see Emerald Valkyrie right here. Emerald Valkyrie is worth 940,000 Robux. So if we're looking at his inventory, it should be placed approximately between Eerie Pumpkinhead and Golden Robloxian. But it's not here at all, even though he does own it in his inventory and I can send him a trade for it. For example, my Emerald Valkyrie for his, but I'm not sending... And so... Of course, there's like Roblox. You would think Roblox is like some super secure account that nobody can get into. So was Roblox hacked? Well, no. Okay. So let's just go ahead and take an item that both Linkmon and Roblox have owned. You have Roblox Dominus Frigidus. Now, nobody else owns Roblox's Dominus Frigidus. And nobody took it from him. But if you go to his inventory, it doesn't show a Dominus Frigidus. So what's the deal here? Well, like I said, Roblox has have been having a lot of issues with the site, and I believe this is just a bunch of, like, scanning errors with the systems that be. Nobody lost any items. Unless Linkmon decided he wanted to USD sell all of his items overnight, I don't think that really happened. Um, I believe that stuff went weird here. So, for example, yeah, he had Frigidus number 25. If we look at his, all of his big items that apparently he doesn't own anymore, he still, nobody else owns the Dominus Frigidus he owns. Nobody else owns the Dominus Astra he owns. And nobody else owns the Dominus Infernus he owns. So nobody lost any items. So why does it seem like these people are broke? Well, let me introduce you guys to a little concept called 32-bit integers. Go to this page right here. User IDs are going over 32-bit on December 7th. Hello developers, every time a user signs up at Roblox, they get a user ID, an ever increasing integer. As some of you may have noticed, Roblox user IDs are getting pretty big. There's over 2 billion of them now. And here's the thing, so let me try to explain this to you guys. So basically, as far as numbers go, written in binary, and that's how the, where the term bit comes from. And user IDs were only meant to have 32 bits, which means the maximum value a user ID could have is this number right here, approximately 2.1 billion. And since there's 2 billion users and there's millions of Roblox accounts being created all the time, we're going to reach that number soon. And so instead of Roblox completely suffocating from them passing the number, they decided to disable signups for a few hours and be really buggy and strange and outdated for a bit. But they're artificially increasing the limits of users. So yes, Roblox was about to run out of accounts. Now I do think that these two things are related. 
Roblox running out of accounts, and all these users seemingly going broke. The whole website broke when they were trying to implement this. So if we go to Inception Times Twitter, a very notable Roblox admin, the other day he tweeted, For those who are missing assets, what are you missing and when did you notice? We're looking into this. And then they said, you should get anything that disappeared back automatically. But the weird, the disappearing assets weren't the only thing that happened. For example, this person has nine administrator badges. Is this due to the weird madness of Roblox a few days ago? Possibly. It was all around the same time. So, and if we go to his profile to check for myself, because who am I to believe some screenshot? Well, <laughs> you can see it right here. What in tarnation? Yeah, man, it's pretty strange to see this stuff, but hey, you know. Roblox be doing its thing. So, there are user IDs that exist, but the ones before it don't exist. So, there's a bunch of test accounts where they're putting in 64-bit integers. See why it's called int64, int64. And these user IDs are in the 2.2 billions, even though Roblox has not even reached that point yet. In fact, if I look at the 2.1 billion and 99th ID, that account doesn't exist but they skip straight the 2.2 billion, skipping over nearly 100 million Roblox accounts that were never created just so they could implement this new update. So yeah, it's pretty interesting to see these accounts that start in the 2.2 billion range. Credit to a Roblox user named Ek underscore S for showing me this. But when Roblox was going through all this carnage when all that stuff was happening, Basically, a whole bunch of weird crap was happening. There was an ad on Roblox saying, buy Builders Club now, even though Builders Club hasn't been a feature for over a year. But the whole thing is, Roblox has been acting very strange lately. They even disabled the creating of accounts for a few hours, a few days ago on December 2nd or 4th, whatever it was, Roblox was going through some mayhem. So his link bond really broke. Well, I mean, he just changed his outfit while I was recording the video. I mean, look at him wearing Rainbow Shaggy, even though if you go to his inventory in the present day, there is no Rainbow Shaggy. So how could he be wearing a Rainbow Shaggy if he doesn't own one? Because it's all glitched. So yeah, I hope I tried to make y'all understand the situation a bit better. What I do find kind of strange is that Son of Sevenless, the other richest player on Roblox and Alta Shedletsky's inventory, is perfectly fine. Nothing's been touched, he owns everything he owns, and he is the richest player as of now due to these scanning errors. So I don't know what the whole deal is. Is Shedletsky immune from all these glitches? I don't know, but it's very interesting to see nonetheless, and yeah. So that's about all I have to talk about today. Thanks for watching the video. Make sure you smash that like button. Follow me on Instagram at Fave here. Follow me on Twitter at Roblox Fave. Join my groups on Roblox, the Roblox Fave fan club and Fave's Cave. Join my Discord server, discord.gg slash Fave. And it's your boy Fave, and I am 